फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू अभिव्यक्ति इंडिया फ्यूचर क्लासरूम इन टूडेज एपिसोड वी विल सी द सम्स फ्रॉम क्वांटिटेटिव एप्टीट्यूड एंड द टॉपिक इज टाइम एंड वर्क वेलकम टू एक्सेल इन पीओ एग्जामिनेशन हियर इज द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन ऑन द स्क्रीन दैट टू मेन एंड सेवन बॉयज can do a piece of work in 14 days whereas three men and eight boys can do it in 11 days in how many days can eight men and six boys do a work in three times as long as the first here in the first case two men and seven boys they do a work in 14 days in the second case three men and eight boys they do finish a work in one 11 days and in third case it is asked that if eight men and six boys are working then in how many days they will do three times as that of first condition so here in the first case two men and seven boys are working and they finish the work in 14 days so in one day they will complete 100 by 14 work this much of percent work two men and seven boys will finish in one day if you multiply by 14 to this side you will get it 28 men plus 98 boys is equal to 100 percent work it means that 28 men and 98 boys together will complete the work in one day they will do 100 percent work in one day now in the second condition three men and eight boys they work together and complete the work in 11 days it means in one day they finish 100 by 11 percent work because we are taking a work as 100 percent that total work is 100 so three men and eight boys will finish 100 by 11% of work in one day so if you multiply by 11 to this side you will get it as 33 men plus 88 boys that is equal to 100% work so 33 men and 88 boys will finish 100% work in one day now see here at this equation and this equation here 28 men increased to 33 men it means what five men are increased but when five men are increased here 10 boys are decreased so the ratio of men is two boys is 5 is to 10 means for two boys there is one man therefore one man is equal to two boys one man is equal to two boys now here we have to compare third and the first case in the first case there are two men and seven boys two men and seven boys but two men one man it means two boys and therefore it will be and one man means two boys so this will be four boys and four boys plus seven boys that will be equal to 11 boys so two men and seven boys that is equal to 11 boys and in the third case there are eight men 
प्लस सिक्स बॉइज सो एट मैन प्लस सिक्स बॉइज दैट विल बी इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी टू बॉइज बिकॉज रिप्लेस एट मैन बाय टू बॉइज फॉर वन मैन सो इट विल बी ट्वेंटी टू बॉइज नाउ वी हैव टू फाइंड दैट इन हाउ मेनी डेज कैन एट मैन एंड सिक्स बॉइज डू द वर्क थ्री टाइम्स एज लॉन्ग एज द फर्स्ट सो हियर इलेवन बॉइज complete the work in 14 days 14 days in the first case 11 boys complete the one work in 14 days then 22 boys will finish three work because it is three times three work in how many days here we take it like this it is inversely proportional and this is also inversely proportional so we write it as x by 14 is equal to 3 by 1 multiplied by 11 by 22 and after solving this we get 21 days and therefore eight men and six boys can do a work in three times as long as the first in 21 days here is the another question that two men and one woman can do a piece of work in 14 days while four women and two men can do the same piece of work in 8 days if a man gets rupees 90 per day what should be the wages per day of a woman now two men and one woman finish work in 14 days two men and four women finish it in 8 days man gets 90 rupees per day and what a woman should get per day now here two men and one woman two men and one woman work together and finish the work in 14 days let there be a 100% work so in one day they will finish 100 by 14% of work now multiply by 14 to this side and you will get it 28 men plus 14 women 14 women that is equal to 100% work means 28 men and 14 women will finish 100% work in one day so in the second case it is two women and four two men and four women two men and four women they finish the work in 8 days it means in one day they finish 10 by 8% of the work now multiply by 8 to other side so you will get 8 to the 16 men plus 32 women they will finish 100% work in one day now here in this two cases if you see that there are 28 men and here there are 16 men it means the men are reduced by 12 and women are increased by 18 so the ratio is 12 is to 18 that is it is 2 is to 3 it means their wages are to be divided into 2 is to 3 ratio means if a man is getting 3 woman should get two part so a man is getting 90 rupees man is getting rupees 90 and therefore a woman should get 60 rupees therefore the woman's wage, wages per day is 60 rupees and man's wages per day is 90 rupees Now the next question is Kaveri takes twice as much time 
as kanti and thrice as much as kalpana to finish a piece of work they together finish the work in one day find time taken by each of them to finish the work now here kaveri i did not by k1 kanti by k2 and kalpana by k3 let there is a one work and kanti finishes the work in x days k2 finishes it in x by 2 and k3 finishes it in x by 3 days so kanti k1 she finishes 1 by x work in one day k2 finishes 1 by x by 2 work that is 2 by x work in one day and k3 that finishes 1 by x3 work x by 3 work in one day that is 3 by x work in one day and if they work together they finish the work in one day so k1 one day's work plus k2's one day work 2 by x plus k3 her one day's work will be 3 by x and this is equal to 1 if you solve this you get it as 3 plus 2 plus 1 that is 6 by x is equal to 1 and therefore x is equal to 6 so kaveri finishes the work in 6 days kanti finishes it in 6 by 2 that is 3 days and kalpana she finishes in x by 3 that is 2 days friends friends here are few suggestions just click on the link to watch the video allegations part 1 banking and other abbreviations mixed bag number 3 current affairs mcq number 2 alphabet series from reasoning and simple interest tips and tricks friends i hope you must have enjoyed it if yes please don't forget to like it by pressing a thumbs up button don't forget to share it with your friends do not forget to subscribe so that you will get updates right into your mailbox and finally visit us at www.excelinpoexam.in friends if you have disliked it please share your suggestions with us through comments because there is always a room for improvement thank you very much friends you might have enjoyed this video then go to thumbs up button and click then go to share tab and share with your friends on facebook twitter google plus and many more and to get the updates right in your mailbox don't forget to subscribe thank you very much